हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे अवर टॉपिक इज शूटिंग टेक्निक्स ऑफ ऑर्चरी शूटिंग एक्टिविटीज इन्वॉल्व प्रोफिशेंसी टेस्ट ऑफ एक्सी प्रिसेशन एंड स्पीड इज कॉल्ड शूटिंग टेक्निक्स ए वे ऑफ कैरिंग आउट ए पर्टिकुलर टॉस्क स्किल और एबिलिटी इन ए पर्टिकुलर फील्ड इज कॉल्ड टेक्निक्स ऑफ ए रिलेशनशिप बिटवीन ए पॉट एंड ए होल इज कॉल्ड ऑफ ऑर्चरी शूटिंग विद बो एंड एरो स्पेशली एट ए टारगेट एज ए स्पोर्ट इज कॉल्ड ऑर्चरी शूटिंग टेक्निक्स ऑफ ऑर्चरी और एज लिस्टिड बिलो मीन्स एक्टिविटीज इन्वॉल्व प्रोफिशेंसी टेस्ट ऑफ एक्सी प्रिसेशन एंड स्पीड इज कॉल्ड शूटिंग techniques a way of carrying out a particular task skill or ability in a particular field of a relationship between a pot and a hole is called of archery shooting with bow and arrow especially at a target as a sport is called archery or as listed below means or as marked under the bow is held in the hand opposite to the archer's dominant eye though holding the bow in the dominant head side is advocated by some means a knot tied with two loops and two loose ends kept on the other hand of archers having power and influence over others the opposite hand is called the drawing hand or string hand means the hand that holds the bow is referred to as the bow hand its arm the bow arm the opposite hand is called drawing hand or string hand right eye dominant archers hold the bow with their left hand have their left side facing the target side towards the target with their right eye and handle the arrow and string with their right hand means the archers whose right eye as having power and influence the archers keep the bow in his left hand after each end the competitors walk to the target to score and retry their arrows means in the time following a person who takes part in sporting contest go to the place and selected as the aim of an attack for the record of point and bring back from arrow from the target point targets are marked with 10 evenly spaced concentric rings which have score values from 1 to 10 assigned to them in addition there is an inner ring sometimes called the x ring means the recurve target is 122 cm in diameter with a 10 ring 12.2 cm in a diameter the compound target is 80 cm in diameter with a ring 8 cm in diameter in international competition compound targets only include yellow red and blue rings in addition to this there is an inner 10 ring sometimes called x ring this becomes the 10 ring at indoor compound competitions while outdoor it's serves as a tie breaker with the archers scoring the most x winning the number of hits may also be taken into account as another tie breaker the flag should be near to the ground as it practical evil means the flags are colored as from the center gold red blue black white that is the colors of an archery target each arrow score points depending on which scoring zone it lands in scoring zones are defined by maximum radius from the flag pole archers shoot ends of six arrows then when 
given the signal to do so archers proceed to the target area means an archer shoots either three arrows per end in indoor shooting or six arrows per end in outdoor shootings after each end the competitors walk to the target to score and retrieve their arrows a clout round usually consists of 36 arrows a clout archery is a form of archery in which archers shoot arrows at a flag from relatively long distance and score points depending on the how close each arrow lands to the flag in clout archery it comprises 36 arrows they can shoot one way or both directions means only three day archery tournament has been holds all three types of clout rounds a single clout round consists of three dozens arrows shot in ends of six arrows tournaments typically consist of double clout round in which a total of six dozen arrows is shot they can shot one way or both directions means the archers can shoot the arrows in one directions only for allowing movements in the opposite directions all bow types make complete long bow recurve bear bow and compounds means completely coins of a weapon for shooting arrows typically made a curved piece of wood joined at both ends by a tight string long bow a large bow drawn by hand and shooting a long feathered arrow it was the chief weapon of english armies from the 14th century until the introduction of fire arms recurve means a recurve bow is a bow with the limbs that curve away from the archer's ben on strung a recurve bow stores more energy and delivers energy more efficiently than the equivalent straight limbed bow giving a greater amount of energy and speed to the arrow extreme recurves make unstable ben being strung berry bear bow the bear bow is the only bow that you can exactly where you want to shoot without any help he said we decide when to shoot what we enjoy it so much that sometimes it might look that's all we are doing compound bow in a modern archery a compound bow is a bow that uses a levering system usually of cables and pulleys to bend the limbs the pulley cam system grants the users a mechanical advantage and so the limbs of a compound bow are much stiffer than those of a recurve bow or long bow thanks and have a